We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, an intriguing matchup between the Miami Marlins and the Milwaukee Brewers. Major League Baseball on the show is next. Robbie Ray, a southpaw from Tennessee, is the man on the mound. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Hey, this guy has a four-pitch repertoire, right? And those are a lot of nice options to have. You can go hard soft. You can go in and out. And any time you have four pitches, if you can throw them for strikes, you have the big advantage. Ready now for the Marlins? Eddie James. And there's a look at his home and road splits so far this year. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. There's a swing, and he sends a ball high in the air into left field. Gone! Big dogs got to eat. It's a two-run shot to straightaway left. Number 25 for him on the year. And the Marlins have taken a two-to-nothing lead. Well, d you know, they say records are made to be broken. And what a monster year this guy's had. Yeah, there it is, Dan. Ready to take his hacks again. Eddie James, as he'll look to follow up the two-run homer he launched over the wall last time up. Line drive to left. And that's off the left field wall. The throw into second. And he will get he in there at second base as he's got himself a wall ball double. Looks like the pitching coach is going to come out and have a word with him. Don't like to see that in the second inning, but once he makes sure he's okay physically, I'm sure it'll be just words of encouragement the rest of the way. Brian here now the 2-2. Changed up on him here, and get this out, is grounded out, to short. Get out. Throw to first will get him easily, and the side is retired. So two home runs in the inning lead to three runs on the scoreboard. We'll go to the bottom half of inning number. Trying to pick things up where we left now off. Back. Eddie left James field. already Eddie. a home run and a double Eddie. for him in this one. Ready to deliver. Here's the first pitch. Hard on the ground towards short, and he'll go the short That's way now. to retire the side. And that'll bring up Ben Gamble. And we'll see what Go he can do here with a pair of runners ben. on base and two gone here Gamble. in the fifth. That's lifted the other way out to left. Left fielder is on the move. And this one will bounce into the wall. He pulls into second safely as a run will score on the play as well. Eddie James will stand in here, but before he does, let's take you back to the very first inning. This was a two-run home run right out of the gate that really got these guys off to a fast start. Hit hard on the ground to short, and that finds its way through for a base hit. Dan, with that single, he's now three-quarters of the way to hitting for the cycle. Toughest one still on the shelf, though. He's got to get a triple. Yeah, that's your set at D-Row. That's one of those that's either got to hit right down the now line or one of those tweeners in the gap. Ryan. He has enough speed, so if he can find a gap or find one down the line. A swing and a miss. That retires the side, and that will do it. Leave one as they hang on to their 5-3 lead. Here's the catcher, Travis Darno. He'll be the man to lead things off here in the bottom of the seventh. Chisholm into shallow left. He can't get to it. This one's down. Hey, sometimes that's how a rally gets started right there. I know it's a soft liner, but leadoff man on usually poses problems. The second baseman. Here it comes, 0-2. In the air after straightaway left. James will settle under it to make the play for the first out as the runner will have to head back to first. Yeah, that's what you want to do when you're playing on the road. Take it right to the home squad and get a win. Now the pressure is off. If they get one of the next two, the series is theirs. And this evening's contest comes to a close. 5-3 the final. The Miami Marlins jumped out to an early lead in the first and never looked back. Sandy Alcantara takes the win on the mound his second of the year. Robbie Ray was unable to work out of the second inning as he saddled with the loss. 
Clayton Tennis earns the save out of the bullpen, his seventh of the campaign. So that's a wrap here tonight. For Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, and Heidi Watney, this is Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching now, MLB The Show. For more, tonight, find us on Twitter, for at the MLB Miami The Show. Marlins. Five runs on nine hits. No errors. They left nine runners on base. So it would appear we'll have a pinch hitter coming on now with a runner at first and one gone. Your attention, please. Pinch hitting for the Marlins. Number 69, Eddie Jay. Hey, keep it going. Stay hot, huh? Smoke toward the hole. And a backhanded reach at first, but he can't flag it down. Down, 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 down. And he is hey, in there. Give me the throw. Hey, after that base knock right there, he's into double digits, Dero. That's a 10-game hitting streak. Oh, you talking about double digits, Dan? Now it's getting firm. We're seeing the batting average go up. We're seeing the homers go up. We're seeing the RBIs go up. Everything is moving north. Reined in. And he is hung out to dry as they tag him out. Yimi Garcia gets the call from the pen to take over. And a nice job here to come in and slam the door. That's his first save of the season, but it certainly won't be his last. Close one tonight, 2-1 to one, the final score. The Brewers took the lead in the fourth and held on until the end. Two runs, seven hits, no errors. They left five men on base. Davey Garcia. MLB The Show's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Today we've got a good matchup in store between the Miami Marlins and the Milwaukee Brewers. Stay tuned for Brewers Baseball next. Alec Bettinger will be the man on the mound for the Brewers. Dan Plezak, what do you got? Hey, hitters have had their way with this guy this year. This is a stat any pitcher doesn't want to have attached to him. The league hitting over 300. That's righties and lefties hitting over 300 against this guy. That's something he's going to address. Meanwhile, now, this is a drive out to straightaway right field, and it's going to get out of here. A home run. A solo shot here to straightaway right field. Number 26 for him on the season as the Marlins will take a one to nothing lead. Two home runs in three days. I'd say he's seeing the ball pretty well right now. I think it's time to start pitching around it. Ready now, Miguel now Sano. Batter. And he's got runners at the corners here with only one gun. Runners are at the corners with one man out. And he takes a big swing at that one as this one's lifted high in the air and deep out to left field. And this ball is gone. No chance to make a play on that one. Hey, that's the price you pay right there when you try and sneak a fastball past this guy. Power hitter, and every power hitter in the league knows you got to start with the numero uno. No? At the plate, Eddie James. And he's the reigning recipient of the National League's Player of the Month Award. We all know this guy's a real good fastball hitter. We saw how far he could hit one. He got a fastball that he liked, and he turned that thing around, okay, and it got out of here in a hurry. Up. Now this is cut and thrown to first. And now he'll try and scurry back to first, but the throw rings him out to dry. So the big bat of Miguel Sano digs in next. Yeah, that last at bat, Daddy, he turned that fastball around. He didn't hit it a ton. He didn't hit it a country mile. But, hey, listen, a home run is a home run. And that'll get down for a base hit. Three, three. And he is in the second base with a double. His third hit this afternoon. Digging in, Ben Gamble. Two hits and two trips for him thus far. The left fielder. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Left fielder giving two, chase. Two, two. He's not going to have a play on it, and this might bring home the runner from first. No, no, no. And they've really got something going here. Runners at second and third to start the inning. 
Now at the plate, Up Eddie next. James, already two for two. He'll look to add on Eddie. right here. James. Swing and a line drive. But this will land foul as he didn't miss by much. Into the windup, here comes the 0 and 1. A swing and a drive to center field. That one's got a chance. Center fielder going back. And that one is gone. So it's a solo shot to dead center. His second home run of the game. But they're going to need a few more here as they're still well behind. Well, we've now seen four homers combined between these two clubs today. What are your thoughts, guys? Yeah, Matty V, one of the things you look for when you come to a Brewers game at Miller Park, you want to see Bernie Brewer go down the slide, and Bernie Brewer's fanny's got to be a little bit sore. So yeah, digging in now, Eddie James. He's looking to go Eddie. four for four with a base hit right here. This guy's having a pretty good week so far in one game. His last at bat is second home run of the game. We'll see if they'll pitch him a little bit more carefully in this A.B. And he dives to make a spectacular catch. What a play there to end the inning. Worth a second look here as this is a beauty to end the inning. More matinee baseball here on a... Ready for another shot now. Eddie now James. Left He'll look field. to keep it going three Eddie. for four so far yeah. in the ballgame. First pitch on its way. And he grooves the yeah, fastball there. This is hit high and deep out to straightaway center field. And that one is gone. So a three-run shot to left center, his third home run of the ball game. As they try to claw back, it's a five-run deficit. Well, talk about having a day. Three home runs in one game. We've heard about the hack trick in hockey, but it's awfully hard to do that in the baseball game. Yeah, and in this game, you always try to find a way to be hopeful. They win the first game of a new month and are now looking to keep it rolling the rest of the way. 14 to 9 is the final score here. Milwaukee put up a 15-run attack on the scoreboard today. Alec Bettinger wins his third of the season. George Jansen is slapped with eight earned runs as he takes the loss. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Thank you for joining us here this afternoon.